help you access your email that has been sent to reset your password for your Aquinas.com account. So we're going to start by looking right at this main page here. And in this main page, you'll see that we did get the email that's that, or the notification that the email was sent to the Aquinas to our website or our email address. So we're going to go over here and we're going to click on go back to our main page. We'll go to our quick links. Quick links says access quickly to. Office 365 and if we click right on Office 365 right here, it's going to bring us to this login here. We're going to enter in our login information uh, for your for most of us, it's going to be our last name. First two letters, our first name at AquinasROC.com. This one. Just a little bit different, but ours is going to be our last name. First two letters, our first name at AquinasROC.com. Next, we're on our password. If you are unaware of your password, please make sure that you talk to a faculty member and the faculty member will get you your password information. All faculty members can reset any student password. If, however, you cannot locate a faculty member at the time, please make sure you go upstairs and see Mr. Marche on the second floor and he will uh, help you access that information. Just Once you've accessed your Aquinas Rock information, it's going to ask you whether you want to stay in. I would suggest you say yes. For the school day, it does make it a little bit easier. Once here, this is your main landing page for the Aquinas Institute Office 365 account. You can see that we are in Office 365 school. It does give us access to everything such as PowerPoint, Excel, and Word. But what we're going to be looking for is Outlook over here. There's a couple different ways to enter into Outlook. One is by clicking on the Outlook button right here. The other is by going to what we call the Waffle. Waffle has access to all the different apps that are available for us to use while we're in Office 365. But for us today, we are going to look for the Outlook app. Once here, we are going to look at the information that was emailed to us so that we can have access to it very quickly. First is our username. We're going to go ahead and look at our username. In this case, it's, we can find that our username is student SU. For you, it's going to be your last name. First two letters, your first name. Next, we're going to do our password request. Um, our password request is going to go through an, a URL. That URL is going to reset our password for us. So we're going to go ahead and click on that URL to bring up the new password page. It's going to say, hey, we want to be able to have a new password. The new password must be at least eight characters long, include at least one number. We do ask for one special character as well. So please make sure you do that. And you can look at the password if need be by clicking on the eyeball right here and it'll show you make sure you have the password. And if everything's done correctly, we're going to get the oh. get the information that says hey uh, please make sure that you put this in correctly and as you can see it's always entertainment and once you've done so it will go through it will reset your password and I'll drop you into your account your next video we're gonna go through what happens once we're in this account